Mr. Tanzig, sir? What's wrong, Thomas? Um, I was just thinking, do you think we can win this case? Absolutely. I think Mattel has ruined your show long enough, don't you agree? Yeah, I think so. That's a good engine. Now come on, let's get this over with. Sixteen? What's he doing here? Hello, Thomas. Lovely to see you again. Hi, Sixteen. Hello, Mr. Matt. So, Thomas, are you here to discuss more business with us? Actually, no. I'm here to end the partnership between Mattel and Sodor. What? You can't do that. We had an agreement. We had a contract. I don't fucking care. Your company is ruining my show. Isn't that right, Mr. Tanzig? Absolutely. I've seen many fans on the internet, a lot of fans, well, too much to count. They hated the reboot ever since it was announced. So, said Mr. Matt, as long as my company is getting more money, I can care less what the fans think. Oh, really, said Thomas. If you don't care about what the fans say, then I'm guessing you are a corrupt man with a corrupt business. Does it look like we care, said Sixteen. You can't stop us. Oh, really? Mr. Tanzig, can you move, please? Uh, yeah, sure. Come here, 16. I want to have a little alone time with you. No, leave me alone. Are you going to do something about this? Your client is attacking my private engine, shouted Mr. Matt. I don't care, said Mr. Tanzig. Ah! Come on, Mr. Tanzig. Let's get out of here. Agreed. Mr. Matt, are you okay? No. No! <sighs> I'll get you for this, Thomas. One day, I will get you, and you will pay for killing Mr. Matt. You will pay!